From adding new blocks to changing core mechanics, mods are a great way to improve the experience of the game. This tutorial is going to show you how to install mods on your 7 Days to Die server. The first step is to go to 7 Days to Die Mods.com. No registration is required, so you are able to manually download any of the mods from this site. Before you download any mods, make sure it matches the current game version you are running. Select your mod and hit the download link. Each mod will need to be installed locally and on your server, so first we will install it locally. Open up Steam, right click on 7 Days to Die, go to Manage, and select Browse Local Game Files. Once the 7 Days to Die Game Files folder is opened, look for a folder called Mods. If there isn't a folder titled Mods, go ahead and create one. Open up the Mods folder, then extract the mod you already downloaded into this folder. Your mod's XML file should be located within its own folder within the mods folder like this. Now we will need to install the same mod on the server. Stop your server and open up your FTP client. In this instance, we are using FileZilla. Create a mods folder within your server's directory if one doesn't exist already. Like before, open up your mods folder and extract the mod into this folder while making sure the mod has its own root folder. Once these steps are complete, go ahead and start up your server. Check to make sure the mods were loaded correctly. You are now ready to play on your server with your new mod. If you found this video helpful, please help us out by dropping a like and make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Comment below with any other videos you'd like to see us make next.